Hello, in this tutorial we are going to cover the iBooks app. The iBooks app is an orange icon with a book on it. Tap on that to begin. In the top left corner you'll see the word library or you may see the word store. Um, we are already in our store so we're going to tap on the word library just to show you that this will take you to your bookshelf. This is the place where all your books have been stored that you have purchased. In the top left corner tap store again to go back to the iBooks store. Now you can search for books by all categories in the top, fiction, nonfiction, mysteries, or you can tap more for a selection of more genres. At the bottom, you can search by featured books on iTunes, New York Times bestsellers, top charts, top authors, and you can look at the books that you have already purchased. We're going to go to the top right corner and we're going to search for a specific book. Um, I'm going to look for uh, Emily Dickinson poems. We're going to tap on Emily Dickinson. And now you can see in the top left corner um, you can purchase a book of poems for free. If you browse through you can also purchase a book that would cost money. We're going to select the free one as an example. I'm going to tap on the word free, I'm going to tap on the word get book, and now you can see it's downloading. And it may prompt you to enter your iTunes password. Um, if it does, go ahead and enter your password and then tap OK, and then it will download the book for you. Now if we go in the top left corner to the library, now you can see my Emily Dickinson book is on the left corner. If you would like to delete a book from your library, go to the top right corner and tap on Edit. Now select a book by tapping on it that you would like to delete out of your library. And then you would tap Delete. And it will prompt you to delete the book. I'm going to tap Delete and that will remove it from my bookshelf. If you would like to organize your books by collections, um, you would tap Edit in the top right corner. Select the books you would like to put into a collection and you can tap move in the top left corner and we're going to add new collection we're going to call this classic books and we're just going to tap on done in this menu and tap on the word classic books and that will enter your books into that collection so they're more organized you can see some lines in the top right corner next to the word edit. And here's another way you can organize your books by bookshelf, titles, authors, or categories. To go back to your bookshelf, in the top right corner next to the word edit are some boxes. Tap on that and that takes you back to the visual bookshelf. And this concludes our iBooks tutorial. Mm -hmm.